John did not isolate himself from the world, but he was not of this world. First and foremost, he was a man of prayer. He completely surrendered himself to God, presenting himself as a living sacrifice, and he became a true vessel of the Holy Spirit. He, his work as an apostle, missionary, and miracle worker continues even now. Students at the Serbian seminary of St. John the Deliogin became aware of Vladika's great feat of asceticism. At night, they noticed that Vladika would stay up, making the rounds of the dormitories and praying over the sleeping students. Finally, it was discovered that he scarcely slept at all and never in a bed, allowing himself only an hour or two each night of an offer the rest in a sitting position or bent over on the floor, praying before I kiss. This ascetic feat he continues for the rest of his life. Amen. I find myself here with Theodore, he's a reader here at the Russian Orthodox Church, and today is a special celebration. Can you tell us a little bit about it, Theodore? Today is the first Saturday of July, and we commemorate the departure of uh, our patron saint, St. John of Shanghai and San Francisco, the Wonder Worker. Okay, and what, what makes him um, important to the church? What, what kind of work did he do? Uh, he led, uh, he was a spiritual guide for the Russian immigration up to the October Revolution, when uh, a lot of uh, Russian people had to uh, flee the country. Uh, and um, uh, he uh, was known for his um, ministry uh, and uh, uh, for his work um, to, uh, to not only strengthen the Christianity among, among the Russian people, but also to show the world uh, um, show the world uh, about our traditions. So today's the 50th anniversary of his uh, passing away? That's right. Okay, and uh, so what is the church doing today in order to commemorate that? Uh, today we are, um, uh, we have a bishop coming to our service. It's going to be an elaborate service uh, uh, with the bishop. We call it our Archierarchial uh, service. And know as the intent of every man before it is formed, and strengthen those who are desires of serving thee. Do thou the same, Lord, array in thy fair and spotless virtue, this thy servant who desire to become the paper bearer before the holy mysteries, that he may be illumined and that attained unto the world to come, and he may receive the incorruptible crown of life. <laughs>
Theodore, I have a question. There's a chair in that church that's very special. What's special about it? That was the chair of uh, Archbishop St. John of Shanghai in San Francisco. Wow. Yes. So th that chair was brought from, I guess, Shanghai or San Francisco? San Francisco. So, and it's it's been here and it, it's... Uh, in the Russian church you have a lot of icons, yes? We do. We do, yes. absolutely. Okay. Icons um, um, is... Um, we consider a window into the uh, eternity. Oh, okay. so, a way how we can uh, um, connect our visual senses, how we can focus on, on prayer. All right. uh, we don't pray to the icons, we pray in front of the icons. All right. and, uh, so that way we engage our vision, our mind and our heart. And, and, and Theodore, what's the name of the bishop who came to visit? Um, this is uh, Bishop Mitrofan of uh, New York and East America. Okay, and um, so he came up from up north then? 
That is right. For this very special ceremony. Oh yes, yes. Today we also have ordained uh, um, a new reader. Yes, uh, I saw that. Yes. That was very special. It was very special, yes. Uh, yeah. A reader is a first uh, uh, degree in preschool, so it's a very... Um, it's not a high rank, but it's uh, uh, quite demanding. Yes, and it's a... Uh, from there you move on to priesthood, or it's if a it way to priesthood, if, if you, you wanted to. Yes, if, oh. um, if that's... Uh, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, after the service, we will have uh, a, um, a meal, and um, I'll also have an exhibition today from um, a uh, by a uh, photographic artist from Russia that uh, um, that shares with us uh, his experience of uh, spiritual renewal and spiritual life in modern day Russia. All right. So those are all those photos behind you, then. That is correct. And, and and all these photos are, are have a a, a, spiro, a spiritual connection with a spiritual experience of some sort then. That is correct, yes. All right. And the artist's name is? Ivan Zhuk. Okay. He's a photo, a photo artist. All right. So